Hey guys, Jinlux here, back with our semi-blind playthrough of Morrowind. So last time we killed our first Corpus Stalker in the Underworks of St. Olm's, which turned out to be, well, as we suspected, the skooma-addicted husband of one of the people. And it, it honestly gave me kind of a weird thought, which is like, I'm, I'm legitimately in the game. Or, or, or at least me, the player, is concerned. Like, I do not want to get Corporus. I suspect we're going to at some point, and presumably, presumably that's one of the prophecies, right? That you're you're able to cure a Corporus or whatever. But um, I think I remember that you don't actually cure it; you just mask the symptoms or something like that. I don't. Regardless. I don't want to get it. I don't know if that involves some sort of a quest. Maybe you can't get it until that quest appears or, or something, but I don't know. What I do know is I don't want to get it, because it, as far as I know, there's no cure. And that's kind of revolting. So, let's load this. All right, so we got our the info from her. We need to. There's the one other dude. Um, I don't have any hammers, right? Oh, I do. Uh. Ran out of hammers, but we, <clears throat> excuse me, but we were able to, you know, restore most of our stuff. So I want to find the last guy wherever, or yeah, they're they're in the Hall of Wisdom, right? And I want to see what this is. We also are still floating. I do kind of want to go into the storage area and deal with those bone lords. Uh, but I would kind of like this to wear off before we do. Ah, so yeah, okay, there, uh, and I'm stuck. God damn, I hate this flying. Stop. Where? Okay, well, there we go. I'm over encumbered now, am I? Okay, so it is a Daedric Shrine. Can I freaking get rid of this stupid levitate thing? I'm so frustrated by it. I mean, I understand it's it's great for moving around, but for for freaking combat, it's like it really sucks. I mean, maybe if I was a marksman, I mean, I am. I'm technically an archer, but if I if I wanted to, I could float and then shoot them. But I don't want to do that. You know, you know what I'm saying? I want to level my spear, and I'm pretty decent with the spear, you know? So, it's... I, I just want it to go away. And that's the thing, I don't know... I don't know how much time... It probably lasts for 12 hours or something like that. I don't know how long it'll last, but... It's, um... I mean, I suppose I could wait. Hit up a bed and just rest or something. Did I? Oh man. Yeah, okay. Well. Let's go try dealing with those MFers. I don't know how I died so quickly. And I'm stuck on the frickin' wall or whatever again.
Okay, that's one. Oh, you have a crossbow. No. Oh, that's whatever is bad. Come on, dude. I, oh, Jesus freaking Christ. I get frustrated because it's like I'm stuck on the walls. I'm floating, like I'm going backwards. And I end up floating up because I'm kind of looking down. And then it just gets worse as I'm... You know, I float up a little bit, so I look down. So I, I'm trying to back up, and that makes me, like, kind of... I just sort of angle downward. It's just... And then I get caught in the frickin' walls, and I fall, and then I get back up, and I fall, and I'm like... Where, um... Do I have Dispel? I do. 4%. My back's all tight. I'm a little frustrated too, because it's like, if I go sit in the massage chair, which is what I need, Manny will get in my, Manny's right there. He'll get in my frickin' right here and he'll want to make biscuits on my neck. And it's like, dude, you know, your dad's hurting right now. Leave me the fuck alone. But he doesn't, he doesn't know. He thinks he's being adorable. And he is, but it's like, I'm, you know, if I'm in pain, I need you to just chill out. It's like, it's like your kids want to play and they like, you know, I'm, I'm laying there because my back hurts or whatever and your kids just like jump on you. It's like, dude, get the fuck away from me. <laughs> you know, it's like, I love you, but get away. Do I want to try this again? I guess. Oh, and I'm freaking stuck. Okay, what is going on? Where am I getting shot from? Is it the, that dude? Alright, we're gonna- we're gonna stop until this fucking thing wears off. This dude, he's got some enchanted weapon. This dude's shooting enchanted stuff at you, and the other one is just easy easy to kill, but yeah, this freaking levitate sucks. Um... Alright, well, while this is wearing off... Oh, come on! And then, yeah. You get stuck stuck on doors and stuff. That's... Can I... Oh, you can. Well, that's interesting. Man, I just get caught on everything. Every little piece of the environment. Just frickin' everything, dude. I mean, Levitate is super useful. Hey, Manny, see, this is... I love you, you crazy motherfucker. <sighs> oh, God. They just want to be around me all the time, which is really nice, and I like it, but... There's times where I'm just like, dude, please, your, your dad's got a headache. And a backache. You know, I need to sit in the massage chair. Or something. Alright, well, maybe, maybe we will try that here, after this. Okay, thank you. You are my adorable kitten. Alright, where the hell am I going? To the Hall of Wisdom, right? Which is... here?
It's interesting that, um... What's her name? Didn't get me... She didn't give me any notes. Right? Okay. Temple Priestess works in the libraries at the Hall of Wisdom and Justice. Just walk around. Do not... Ask about her. Got it. Well, let's... You know, it could have... It's As far as a blessing goes, it's pretty good. It's a hun 100 points, you know? You're my manny. So at least we move pretty quickly. And I do appreciate that. Oh, I see. Nope, that's the high fit. Am I in the right place? Oh, high fane. Speak, traveler. Oh, you have an actual name. You're not ordinator. Uh huh. Okay, latest rumors. Tanusia Veloth has the Divine Disease, but she refuses to leave the city. Divine Disease? Is that Corpus? Okay. Have this new secret cult, Six House. Okay. Yep, okay. Anyway. Oh, yeah, actually, tell me about the Puzzle Canal. Beneath the Palace of the Vivek is the Puzzle Canal, place of worship and testing for questing heroes. Yep, okay, fair enough. <sighs> yeah. And then you keep getting stuck. All underworks. Speak, traveler. Library. You think they have the St. Nerevar books or the Black Glove or whatever? Probably not. She's supposed to be in the library, right? Trapdoor. Temple. Cannon offices. Strange. That's gotta be... Oh, Milo's quarters, really? Right. What is this about? Could you get out of the way? Cannon quarters. Oh. Oh, no weakness or fault. Well, they're locked, so probably not in there. Oh god damn it. Get out of the way. Library. Hall of Justice. <sighs> All right, into the library. Okay. There she is. Oliver Sarathon. What is this about? I do. <sighs> Hall. The three. Dude, they have a look at all these. You could like steal one of these. Maybe even steal a bunch. Like all of those books. Brief history of the Empire. But no, I mean the problem is all these books are not. They're actually not super great. There's a lot of them, but they're all fairly inexpensive. A 
Oblivion. I'm not the oh. true nobles code. So if this oh, is a library, citizen. can I purchase books? Haven't I heard of you? Maybe. Yes, I'm Mira Milo. Kai sent you. Follow me to the back of the library. We can't talk here. Your journal has been updated. What is it, citizen? Is she gonna get attacked or something? Or By the three, my rights to... all right, go ahead. I'm afraid I don't know anything about six house cults, but I can tell you about the Nerevarine cult. Interesting. So the sixth house, really, you don't know much about them. Other than they're smuggling. Oh, they're smuggling stuff. All right, well, let's. Okay, all right. I don't know how much of these I've read before. Okay. Caius is a dear friend. Like me, he admires the best traditions of the temple, charity for the poor, education for the ignorant, protection for the weak. But he is a he is a Westerner, but he has come to love our land and our people. But like me, he distrusts the arbitrary power of the ordinators, and like the dissident priests, he suspects the temple is hiding something. He serves the Emperor, but he also loves Morrowind, and he sees the failing virtues of the temple as a threat to Morrowind's political stability. I mean... Yeah. The failing virtues of the temple. What does that even mean? So is that what we're going to do? We're going to prop up the power. I mean, that's right, because if we're not going to help dig out Ur. We're going to kill him so that way Morrowind stays politically stable. Okay, Daedra, Dagoth Ur, evil immortal enemy of the Tribunal Temple Cult. Tell me about the dissident priests. Dispute temple doctrine and are outlawed and persecuted by the temple. Ordinators arrested and imprisoned heretics and the Empire cannot interfere. Progress of Truth lists their beliefs. In brief, they challenge the purity and divinity of the Tribunal, suggesting their powers are sorcerous. Not divine, and perhaps akin to the powers of Dagoth Ur, which is probably true. I mean, if they're mortal, right, then they're sorcerers. They also condemn the arbitrary power of the Ordinators and accuse the temple hierarchy of self interest and corruption, which is probably true as well. So she's saying progress of truth. I, where do I find all these freaking books, dude? Should I? 54, okay. Okay, that means nothing to me. Perhaps you wouldn't know, but the temple regards disturbing dreams as a sign of soul sickness, a sign the mind is deranged by impure impulses and dangerous feelings. The Ashlanders have many superstitions about dreams, but they have superstitions about everything. Interesting, so we got another keyword. That's really good. Okay. Empire. Who can impose the law and taxes the emperor? His hand lies heavy on our ancient land. Okay. Great houses. The Brown Party of Telvanni honors great traditions and arcane mastery of our race and deserve our respect, but they are careless in observance of temple teaching and scornful of discipline, doctrine, and obedience. Uh, okay. Lesser Saints. Ministry of Truth. We got another keyword, I think. Minister of Truth is a celestial body suspended by Vivek's mighty power or the great temple of the High Fane in Civic City. Vivek City, yeah. Huh, why did this go down, though? Do we not have... Strange. The temple worships Nerevar as a saint and hero, but prophecies of his reincarnation are punished as wicked heresy. 
The Nerevarian cult claims the tribunal are false gods, hence the temple's persecution of the Nerevarian cult. A group called the Dissident Priests dispute temple, do temple doctrine on Nerevarian prophecies. The proscribed book Progress of Truth describes their belief. Get a copy of Progress of Truth for Caius Casatis. That will tell him the things he know about the Nerevarian cult. Um. Okay. Where do I where do I get that? Ashlanders have a mystical tradition of interpreting dreams and visions as prophecies. These prophecies are recorded in verse and may be lost or garbled over the generations. But the distant priests have collected many ancient prophecies of the Nerevarine, many of which they believe to be genuine. Collectively, these are called the Lost Prophecies of the Incarnate. One of the sacred missions of the distant priests is the collection and study of these prophecies. Okay. These people are our ancient enemies. Like all man races, they are of inferior blood, but otherwise are human in every respect. Are they capable of enlightenment? Do they have souls? Who could say? It's funny. Okay, other cults. Persecuted by the temple. Why did the temple persecute the dissident priests? Because attacks on the temple weaken the faith and leave the people defenseless against the influence of Dagoth Ur. Faith is what strengthens the will of the believer against Dagoth Ur's lies. Faith is, faith is the source of the divine power that sustains the tribunal in their battle with Dagoth Ur. Since the Empire, some Dunmer have turned away from the temple. That's why Dagoth Ur grows stronger, why blight storms and monsters threaten the land. Maybe. I mean, if they're actually if they were actual gods. Uh, persecution of the Nerevarine. It's an Ashlander cult. Primitive superstition, says the temple. Nerevarines say the tribunal are false gods. I've never understood why the temple wastes so much energy on them. The faithful cannot be shaken by such attacks, and the Ashlanders are just ignorant savages. But since the submission of the temple to the Empire and the erosion of faith among the Dunmer, the militant wing of the temple is increasingly fierce in its attacks on heretics and heathens. Uh, this book lists the disputes of the distant priests with tribunal temple doctrines. The temple has outlawed the sale or possession of the book, so it will be hard to find. We have a copy here, but I fear I'm being watched by ordinators here. A safer plan would be to search local booksellers. Some booksellers ignore temple bans and outlawed books for profits or for principles. Ah, uh, maybe if I go to that rare book thing, I could be like, I can ask. Yeah. Okay. Saint realms. Saints shrines. Solstheim. time. Saw the sill. Soul sickness is called madness or insanity in the empire. Signs of soul sickness are strange dreams, uncontrollable impulses, and cruel and evil deeds. Madness is not a disease, as Westerners believe, but if it were, it might be cured by blessings and healers. Soul sickness is a curse of Dagoth Ur, who sends dark dreams to attack the weak of faith in their sleep. Those strong in faith can resist, those weak in faith must seek counsel from the temple. Uh, okay. Tribunal. Tribunal Temple, same thing. Vivek, the most gallant knight and the most subtle rogue of the First Council. I do not care for temple politics, but I have read Progress of Truth, and it troubles me. I have friends, former priests, who have gone into hiding, so I'm bound to come to the attention of the ordinators. I'm careful, but I'm afraid. I'm no secret agent like you or Caius. Sooner or later, I too must go into hiding, if it is not too late. When you return to Caius, tell him I am worried, and that if something goes wrong, I will leave a message under the agreed code word, Amaya. Wow, that's, uh, that's dark. I assume something's gonna go wrong. Alright, so... Good luck. Okay. 
I found Mira Milo in the back of the library. She says she's known nothing about the sixth house, but she's willing to answer my questions about the Nerevarine cult. She says the temple persecutes the Nerevarine cult because they claim the tribunal are false gods. A group called the Distant Priest disputes temple doctrine on the Nerevarine prophecies. A book, Progress of Truth, describes the beliefs of the Distant Priests. Mira Milo says I must get a copy of Progress of Truth to give to the spy master. Mira Milo says copies of Progress of Truth can be found in the secret libraries of Hall of Wisdom, but that they are guarded. She says it will be safer to search booksellers for a copy. Some booksellers will sell outlawed books. Tell says to tell Caius Casada she's worried that she's being watched by ordinators. Now, if something goes wrong, she will leave a message under the agreed code word, Amaya. All right. Secret Libraries of the Hall of Wisdom. Well. I mean, I don't think this is... Brothers of Darkness. Reflections on Cult Worship. I assume... Oh, sweet Jesus. Go on about your business. Yeah, I would assume there are not any of these. Book of Daedra, Lives of the Saints. Oh, no weakness or fault. Okay, well. Library of Vivek. Canon quarters, canon offices, hall underworks. We could certainly try it. There's a rat. All right, let's save. Die, rat! Diseased. You have contracted Wit Bane. Mother Trucker. Wow, that's like really, really bad. Okay, let's do a... Uh, I assume it's a common disease? There we go. Oh, this, oh wow, look at this. I mean, I, I assume it's not stealing. Random, random bottle, garbage. Is that a rat? It certainly looks like a rat. See, it's like you you catch on every little thing while you're levitating. It's frustrating. What is this? Iron broadsword, random bedroll. Someone's camping down here. Well, I mean... If they're eating hound meat and they have 16 gold, I'm not going to take their 16 gold. Normally I would, don't get me wrong, I'm, you know, I am a hoarder, after all. 
What am I hearing? Random sounds. Oh, there's another rat. You know, it's interesting, actually. It's... Oh, it sees me now. It actually makes sense that you get, uh... That you get diseases from searching it, searching the body. That makes sense. I gotta say though, this is not bad. The fact that it's so fast, that's, it's pretty good. You're, you have the blight. You have some kind of blight. Yep, I could tell. Man, I want to go check out that shrine, but I can't. Also, we get killed really easily. All right, so... We need to find a bookseller. Let's go check out the progress of truth. Or, I mean, that is the one, but I meant the rare books. Um, hmm. Unless, uh, they talked about some guarded thing. Maybe that's where... Oh, for crying out loud, why can't I get through this trap door? Or move? Going back into your heated kitty bed? That's good. Yep, that's good. He was... He was stressed out from the cat doctor. Unfortunately, I have to bring him back because they couldn't get any pee. Uh, so they're going to have to... They're going to have to get him another time. So the library is... The High Fane? Is that where we're talking? It's very strange. It seems like... Ah, uh, maybe in there? Oh... Well, where... Huh. Speak your needs. Oh, here we go. You know, we're almost, well, right. I was going to say, we're almost done with the pilgrimage. There's an ordinator. Well, where is... Go ahead. The High Fane. From the Hall of Wisdom. Maybe the offices. Let's try the high fane though first. Speak, traveler. And honestly, if if all we did was talk to people and ask them the like, oh, what are the rumors? That might be okay. You know? Oh come on, dude. I what need... is this about? Is it here? Mm, no. Oh crap, how did I Um, hmm, maybe, maybe here-ish? Or not? <sighs> Wait. Okay, let's try here. Oh, well, see, this is a problem. I cannot sneak.
Because I'm floating. Is, uh... Is this the right one? I think this is the right one. Let's do... Let's just... Okay. That's fine. Um... Okay. I assume this is the area that I'm not supposed to be in. Oh, it's fading. Blasphemous Revenants. We'll just, um... I mean, he... He doesn't see us, so that's cool. Pilgrim's Path. Aw. Gosh. Oh, hey. Neat. Well... I assume it's in there. Why can't- why- Dude, I'm like crouching behind you. It does frustrate me that the dude is right there. Uh, maybe- hang on, maybe these um, things work. Uh, it's like surroundings or whatever. What's the other one? Shadow weave. Oh, 10 seconds. Okay. What about this lock spell then? Zero percent chance. Well, okay. I mean, you know, we. All right, hang on. Where are my? Restore Magicka. Crap. Well. Oh, it's exactly 60. Oh, balls. You have been expelled from the temple. Presumably because... Oh, wow, look at this. That's not what I... I... Restore health? Dude. Water breathing. Restore health, Velothia's shield. Summon ancestral ghost. Boathia's walking stick, like, okay. You know what, let's, I'm gonna load. I'm, I'm kind of annoyed with the whole like, I'm hidden, and then I do the thing, and all of a sudden I'm not hidden anymore. I mean, maybe it's like me casting a spell makes me not hidden. I, I, I kind of get that, like, I understand. But, alright, let's just find one. Maybe the... Maybe the lockpick itself is quieter, actually. Oh, yes.
All right. Let's see. Ring of Surroundings and... Oh, lock level 95. I can't... I can't unlock that. Lock 2 complex. Well, I mean... What about the Master's lockpick? Your crime has been reported. You have been expelled. You fuck. F. Mother effer. Of course. I, I mean, I get it. And yeah, it's like... It's... Yes, sure, loading is bullshit, but whatever. Alright, let's just do this. Uh, Let's see. Oh yeah, it's about to expire. That's good. Okay, I'm happy now. Yay, even though we were moving pretty quick. All right, so I want to do... Why did I lose my map? What is it, citizen? Outlander, what do you want? See, this doesn't make sense, right? Why did I lose the map? What is this about? Was was the map dependent upon floating or some crap? I don't know. Okay, back to Saint Quickly, Outlander. I haven't much time. Whoa. All right. How are we in Saint Olms? We're not. We weren't. Okay, whatever. I mean, we're in Saint Olms now, but we weren't there. Um, it was Saint Olms, right? That had the uh, the shrine, canal, South One. Oh, what is this? I'm sure, you have some questions. What would you like to know? Who are you? Little jobs here and there. Grown powerful and ruthless since the Imperial occupation, of great influence in the higher ranks of House Lalu. Yeah, that's... Uh, okay. Latest rumors. Little advice. Little secret. I'm a thief. I was born to be a thief. Alright, cool. Thieves Guild. Nope, so you're not in the Thieves' Guild. What about Morag Tong? No, I can't ask you about that. I'm... I know it sounds silly, but I'm actually a little bit annoyed with the whole... No question. Wait, maybe that's an actual, like... It's like a home. You know, like Canal South... One, two, right? South three. It's like an apartment. Uh, I don't remember what I was saying. Uh, I mean, I, right, I don't know. Tailors and Dyers. Okay. Uh huh. It's down here. Whoa. Yep, shrine. So it is a Daedric shrine. That actually makes me weirdly happy. And I don't have to worry about, uh, you know, being heavy anymore. All right. Uh, not the Lord's Meal, no. Cool. Cool. 
save over this. Right, I mean, there, there's that's what I was going to say. There's a problem with the freaking... Uh, all the books. They told us to find, like, three books about Nerevar. Can't find those. Told us to find freaking the Black Glove or something. Can't find that. Now they're telling us Progress of Truth. I don't even know where that is. I probably need this... Let's do a little bit of woad. Okay, then we're gonna switch to Mighty Blows. Oh, see, that's a problem. I'm getting shot. Oh, come on, dude. And then he knocks me down. That... Yeah. Um... Okay, you. Dude, dude, that guy is... That dude is the biggest threat. I need to... I need to kill him immediately. And, and honestly, magic, like... Okay, where is he? There he is, he's back there. Alright, dude, don't worry, I'm coming for you. Oh, come on. Okay, so the... I mean, they work... They're, they're pretty good. It's actually smart, right? Whoa! What the heck was that? Was, uh... Is she a mage? Unlock, baby. What kind of sword is that? Dude, we're... Are you dead? Whoa! Baby, should I sleep? Can I regenerate? Oh, wait a second, then I'll... But yeah, man, some of those things, it was like, oh, use this to heal. Ten points. Please work. Awesome. Daedric Longsword. Okay. Wow. Bone mold stuff. Okay, so Daedric Longsword. We're gonna take this. We're gonna take these rings. Um, Sanguine Deep Biting. Fortify Axe. Oh! Constant effect. I was like, for how long? Oh, just straight up. Okay. Maybe we'll hold on to that. The bone mold stuff, it's not... I mean, you know. It's medium armor. If I need to, I will... Trapped. Lock level 5. Part of me thinks I should... Well, hang on. Okay, so we have 
Steel poison sword. That makes a lot of sense. Cruel viper bolts. Belt of sanguine hewing. Oh. Oh, so you can only equip one at a time, I suppose. But these are incredible. Steel poison sword. It's a long blade. Cruel viper bolt. And all this stuff we don't we don't need. Are we still uh are we still regenerating here? No, nope, we're not. Can I failed. Damn it. All right, what about you, girl? What do you have? Dwarven short sword. And a bunch of light stuff. Um, I mean, this is similar to the bone mold stuff. You know? Maybe I should grab it and sell it. How we doing? You know what? Now's a good time to stop. Have I seen this dude before? I don't know what this is, but before we take any of it, which I'm going to, we're going to definitely want to heal. I don't know who that is, but I think that's the dude that attacks uh, Oblivion in the end. Or, um... That attacks, uh, that Oblivion's all about. That guy, I think. Anyway, uh, that's it for today, guys. Thank you guys so much for your time and attention. Really do appreciate it. Really hope you guys are enjoying these episodes. As always, guys, questions, comments, concerns, good, better, and different. Let me hear them. I do try and read all of them. I do try and respond to all of them as well. Um, what is your guys' unique positive moment for today? For me, I'm going to say... I tried this cheese... Uh, camembert cheese. It's like a soft. It's it's soft, but it's it's fancy. It's in the fancy cheese aisle. It's got its own little wrapper. Um, it is, it is good, but it has like a, a rind on it, which is. It's not something you can really peel off easily, and if you like eating it because it's safe to do so, um, then then that's great. And I actually see how people could because it's a very... The rind itself is very bitter. I find it super gross. Uh, so I'm going to have to not eat that. But... <laughs> but if you're... Uh, you know, if you've had a lot of stuff and your palate's really refined, it's probably really good. Because it adds that bitterness to the, the creaminess of the cheese itself. I don't know. But I thought the cheese was good, so, you know, that's my unique positive moment. I haven't even eaten all of it. I just had a little bit, and I ate the rind, and I was like, ugh, ugh. But it was definitely a unique experience. Um, but that's my unique positive moment. Hopefully your guys is just as good, if not better. Hopefully better, of course. And I hope to see you guys next time. Till then, guys, take care.